hi guys how are you happy new year yeah. welcome to my youtube channel i've missed saying that i'm lying i've not missed it but um my youtube peeps are always over on instagram asking hi when you come back to youtube hi you from on youtube blah 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 but anyway i decided to come back with this video how are you guys how was your day how is your year are you guys ticking off your goals and all that um i thought i'll do a video but i think i'll title wind down with me um how i get like how i wind down the day um i'm from work right now and yeah what what's my evening routine like this is my evening routine so yeah come from work what i'm wearing here is uniform i work in a place where i wear uniform and thank good for that because it means that i don't have to own too many clothes and it saves me from having to look for clothes every morning anyway so i just reached home i think i got home about 20 minutes ago sat down first just like you know just like sat there did nothing because i'm tired i'm really tired so yeah let the evening begin i don't know if you guys have seen that um that's the tagline for some some gin those ends some gin uh god i've forgotten the name but anyway <clears throat> it's been a minute it's been a minute anyway so um the times that i'll be able to cook dinner but today i don't think we're going to make dinner i'm really tired so it's going to just be tea and popcorn so i've turned on the heater and i'm going to first hang my clothes i'm those people who keep everything neatly somewhere so i'm going to first um hang my clothes i do not wash my i don't wash my skirt each time i use it let me not even lie I, I wear one skirt twice all right i wear it two times before changing it reason being that I do not want that i don't want it to be overwashed i don't want to wash it every now and then and then it fades up so i wear it twice before so i wear one today then i wear a different one the following day then repeat the first one another day like that like that like that <sighs> so my heater is on um my one earring fell out today this one, the shirts though, you gotta wash. You gotta wash because, see this, hair oil, sweat, everything else. Yeah, I'm going to just take this to the laundry basket. But I first have to keep my other things. My stopper fell out. Then I'm going to let my hair down so it can breathe. It's just too strained. Oh, yucks. Oh, oh, oh. That feels like so much relief, Lord. Ah, oh, you guys. Oh, this is exhausting anyway. So let me first. The earrings are kept somewhere else. The whites are somewhere else. Oh, I don't have light in here because it was but, but Guys, the best thing you can do is invest in your bathroom. The best, the very, very best thing you can do. Let me actually give you guys a bathroom tour. Let me first get a towel. Towel. I don't even think this will be visible enough. But I'm just going to walk in. First of all, the reason I don't have this bathroom is not crowded is because I really love space. I love space so much. I don't like lots of stuff, right? So. What I don't like about this bathroom is that it doesn't have something at the bottom right there. You know, to separate the toilet and the bathroom. But that's alright. Let me just bring down the camera a bit. Oh yeah, so. So, there's not really much. Those are artificial plants right here. 
and this is where I put the towels to dry this is for dry brushing I will be sharing a video on that very soon my hair bonnet panty peg but I normally put my underwear outside to dry so this I rarely use I only use it for my sponge actually so this side here this is my best you know the best this is my best place here so these are scrubs on the top on top I have scrubs uh, a cleanser then toiletries right these are for the toilet the Omo is also for the toilet then here I keep my deals my feminine wash things here to do the bathroom I, I used I had bought this for my face but I use it on my hand and arms now and this is a steamer for the first generally things to do with showering and sorry. so I've shared before that I love to make my bathroom really like smell nice I love to make my bathroom smell nice so it's very important to me because it helps me be calm it helps me calm down after a long day and today was a long day i'm so exhausted i'm so exhausted so yeah one of the things is that the one of the bathroom scents i use look like this you stick it to the toilet you stick it to the side of the toilet or to the side of the uh of the tank the toilet tank um then let me show you something else these are just things that i use to shower this is my favorite you can see it's almost done why because i i got sick recently for about for like three months and i didn't like scents right so i like that this soap was not scented that's why I, i've been using it quite a lot i stopped using all the all the bath and body works that i have so I just forced my boyfriend to to use this so that we don't waste the money. Um, another favorite is this one. It came at the right time. I got it as a present from someone called Ruth. And it has, um, I'll be talking about this as well. It's a moisturizing body wash. So these are different from the normal body washes because the other ones can leave you dry, what, what. But a moisturizing body wash actually leaves you, you know, quite moisturized. It leaves your skin quite moisturized. That's why I like it. So I had been looking for them and, you know, being lazy, lazy, what. And then someone tells me I've got you some stuff, what, what. And I check them. It's these moisturizing creams. Then this is for just a lax, you know, bath. Like if I wanted to just have a lax bath, what, what. This would be it. This is from Dove. I think you can get it anywhere. But where did I get this one from? Oh, yeah. My cousin Pingo gave me this. Um, this is a cleanser for my face. This is also a cleanser. So, like, today I have to double cleanse. Because as you can see, it's been a long day. You're in, you know, there's heat, dust, blah, blah, blah. You have to double cleanse. So, this is my feminine wash. It's such a favorite. It's from Dynafarm. Yeah, it's from Dynafarm. A friend of mine who is a member always gets gets it for me and it sells out quickly because this last time i had to wait for like a month for them to restock or for her to get it anyway it's really really good the beauty with it is that it's very thick that it's a consistency is thick so you can even dilute it and keep using hora hora um what else just the shower then um these are just my flowers then this stone is for the feet. I wanted to do a shower routine separately, but I feel like it might go in here. But I go in here. But um, here there's like a lax bath, and then there's one where it chucked up. So anyway, this is for the feet. Chacha. So when it comes to bathroom scents, look at this right here. Let me just turn the camera. This thing here is a bathroom scent. I might not put the number of the person who sold them to me. She's called uh soup right so so my lovely lovely friend so sells this scent so that also who also sold me the other the one that i've shown you guys that i stick to the side of the toilet and yeah i guess that's it for a bathroom tour um yeah that side looks like that i leave my toilet papers here i leave them here because you know it's easy for you to turn you know you're in the toilet the awkward moment when the toilet roll gets done and that's it 
I love to have space so that's why every plate everything is catered for like that that rack also has towels and I guess um, that's it so what next we shower right what next is that we shower we shower we shower I need to first get this thing close off so when I get um when I get my lip gloss off, one of the things that I use after is this, and this is a Ugandan brand. It's a this is a sugar lip scrub. It's a Ugandan brand. Oh, can you please focus? Thank you so much, dearest camera. This is a, it's called Dapa. The brand is called Dapa, so it's Dapa by Rush. This is how it looks like inside. So I'm just going to put on gloss, lip balm. Sorry, take it off. Another thing that I use that I highly, highly recommend, my goodness, let me get it for you. Okay, guys, sorry, I realized that I put that in the routine that comes after. But um, this is one of the best things ever. This is, I've always talked about this, I've always shared about it. This is the Elizabeth Aden 8-hour cream. You can use it as hand lotion or you can use it as what? Or you can use it as lip balm, whatever, whatever. So I put it on my lips to just take off the matte lipstick. So someone gave me a present of organic wipes. And friends, I am sold. I don't know how to go back to being a normal polluter of the environment. But um, someone gave me these as a gift. I absolutely love them. I, even, like, I wish I could tear one kawaii into two pieces and I use it slowly but alas anyway this is something going on my mouth I prefer to use this just take off and it says it says self to flash so that's why I love them I can flash them the smell is nice white yeah, okay, you okay. I'm so tired. So tired. Huh? Okay. Oof, oof. Okay, I'm flashing that. So when I'm <gasps> Lord why Lord why I got in it here it's the lip scrub it has some moisture in it it's like gloss in it so I'm going to let that sit just gonna let that sit so guys, I'm letting the lip scrub seed a bit. And in the meantime, I'm going to go in with my cleanser. It's oily. So just to take off the gunk. So I have two oil cleansers, right? Let me show you. I have this as well. But this is too expensive. I don't like to use it every day so i have this kawan as the okay so i got in with the oil cleanser 
make sure it's sitting in right. So guys, this brush here is for something we like to call dry brushing, right? I'll put the advantages, what, but I'm not going to take you guys through that entire process. But it's, I got some numbness in the body. So part of the reason why I got this. So it helps with blood circulation, uh, helps you know to take off the dirt before um, you know showering before you go in with your normal sponge and stuff but it's like a long process it takes some time doing it so this is not something I do every day right something that I do like twice a week so let me go into that and then I'll be back when I start the entire process okay I'm gonna leave you guys now here let me just let me first go into this drama then be back So like I said guys, <laughs> this is my favorite soap <laughs> and this is the, my favorite sponge. Nothing more than this. So I've been using this soap so much. It's actually made in Uganda. This is made in Uganda. The reason I like it right now is because it has no scent. I can't stand a scent. I can't stand scent. I cannot stand scent. This sponge is so good for your body. It helps to exfoliate. I first do this because the soap is in one place. Then I go in the underarms, guys. You've been sweating the entire day. You're wearing deal, blah blah blah. So the underarms. Shit. I was just getting more than Okay, it's just getting water and water and water. Guys, okay, please do not forget to go under your armpits, go into your underarms. They've been sweating the whole day. So this is part of the care we are giving them. I'm also going to show you my underarms sort of routine. 
I'll do an independent trill for that. But in the meantime, I'll show you. Guys, the soap is done. I'm almost putting in water. Guys, what's happening? The water is either too cold or too hot. Please do not forget to go into in between your thighs. That place has been sweating. If you have a big tummy, please lift your tummy. Lift your tummy. I'm not even playing. Lift your tummy and scrub under your tummy. Your boobs, same thing. They've been sweating the entire day. So please lift your boobs. Lift your boobs because they've been sweating the entire freaking day. So lift your boobs and go under where the brass is because that place tends to collect dust. I mean go under your butt. Yeah, where your butt meets your thighs. Scrub that place please. And thank you the government thanks you. The government of Uganda thanks you for scrubbing. In between your thighs, okay. The citizens are grateful. Friends, watch your influencer get embarrassed. Get embarrassed. Oh, I forgot to mention that this top is from a total. It has no heavy scents. That's what I like about it. So your government thanks you. So it's important that you wash your sponge really well when you're done. See, it still has some soap. Let's do this. Because it keeps bacteria, okay? So you need to protect yourself, protect your body, protect your skin, those things. The water is so nice, too, so nice. The water is dope. So I'm just going to hang it, make sure you hang it and it dries bacteria again. And then for this part, turn on your music and stand under the shower. Or pray. Just keep praying. Then have those, you know those conversations where you quarrel with someone and you don't give the right reply? This is the time to have those conversations. Think about what you should have said. Our feminine wash camera thank you so much for focusing the lord loves you is it going to focus is it hmm. by the way i'll put it down i had told you guys that it's really thick see the consistency that's even a lot that's too much so we're going to go into this part and sum up our shower so in the meantime, goodbye, as we take care of the girl. The girl who makes the world go wrong. Slap does really well. It has, um, it has, um, it's, it, it, it has tea tree oil in it. First of all, you guys, let me tell you a mistake I was making. I would use this thing, and then later I would wash my face. So my face kept getting stingy, feelings. I had, my eyes were swollen. I was wondering, what's wrong? What am I doing wrong, guys? One day, one day, like, let me look at all the products that I'm using in the bathroom. Guess who the help it was? This girl right here. So, anyway, yeah, 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 removes all dark conditions that skin. Man, I've been using this since uh, my friend plugged me on this in 2015, and I've been using it since 2015. 
15. Such a good deal, okay? So anyway, let's go in. So remember, the girl, you can hear the girl and the butt crack, okay? So for now, bye. Hi guys, I'm back. That session is done. So we wash our hands and be very careful. Now I can't touch my face again because yeah, the tea tree was burning me last time. So I'm just going to do just one color, feel good, you know, rotation. And we go, goodbye. Do not forget to wash the ears, okay? And behind the ears, that face keeps dark. It stores dark like a problem. Then here, guys, I recently saw someone with a white shirt on, and early in the morning, as early as 8 a.m., the color was already brown yellow. Woo! Okay. So we are done with that part. You get your towel that is dry properly. I prefer this sort of towel, this kind of towel. There's some towels that I don't like. I'll show you guys those towels, but I like this one that immediately dry you up. Then the next step is quite important. The next step is also very, very, very important. Okay. And here is why it's important. You're not an animal. You live with fellow human beings. So it's important that you leave the bathroom dry for them. Like I told you guys, my bathroom does not have that separation, okay? So you have to leave the bathroom dry for the next user. It's just common courtesy. That's why the squeezer is right here. Goodbye bathroom, goodbye, goodbye. I just realized that my bedroom has no light. I switch off the heater. Oh. Let me just leave the bathroom open to air it. Oh my goodness, I have no light. How am I going to shoot the rest of the video? Huh? 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 I can tell that this camera is doing the best it can with what it has. Okay. You dry yourself thoroughly. That's one of the other important things. You have to dry yourself thoroughly, especially in places that keep water, like under your boobs, under your breasts. Lift your breasts and dry. Um, between your thighs, below your butt cheeks, right? Um, else? Lift your stomach. Yes, that place sweats a lot. So dry that place as well. Um, dry yourself properly because it's very important. That you dry yourself properly however when you're going to moisturize do not you might you have to moisturize when you're still a bit damp okay so that the moisture sets in that's one of the things that has helped me a lot lately because when i came from hospital i was dry my skin was dry my skin was so 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 dry so i had to learn to moisturize while i'm still damp so I'm going to show you guys what I do for my underarms to prevent them from, you know, first of all, smelling the entire day. Smelling the entire day. Uh, it also stops you from sweating quite a bit. Um, yeah, it actually stops you from sweating. It's something that I, do. I discovered. It's a product that I discovered that is your best friend. I will do a reel on this and I'll also do an extensive video on this when i'm doing underarm orders do not worry this time around when i say i'll do videos i mean it i mean it i'm not lying sorry my light blue but i think this can work so this is what we are using this is called glycolic acid and it's from the ordinary and it's seven percent you don't have to use it every day you use it about three times a week okay it helps with 
order the underarm order it helps to you know pre uh, stop you from over sweating blah 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 you know what let me just find light and we do this but anyway this is how it looks like please get this for yourself it will really help you a lot so i just put some on a cotton dab some on a cotton pad like this and go into my underarms it also helps to lighten your underarms that's the other thing that it does me. sorry friends let me see okay this product is also good for lightening your underarms so you just go in huh? do you see that do you see how my underarms look like yeah so you just go in and you leave it overnight i leave this overnight i don't like wash it out I just keep it there. I wash it out in the morning when I'm going to wear a deal. Let me just get for the other side. So friends, I'm just going to keep going back and forth. I don't know, in case you didn't see this well, let me try and focus. Why does this camera hate me so much? There, the ordinary glycolic acid. Um, you can read up about it. It's amazing. In the real, I will include all the advantages. So, see when the light, uh -huh, see the light, you know, goes in so well. Yeah, you clean your underarms like that, and there's not much dirt really. This is how it looks like. So, that's done. The underarms are done. So guys, I'm just going to go in with these three products. Let me put them in this drawer here. But let me first wash my hands so that I do not transfer my material. Let me wash my hands quickly. So, since it's at night, I use this about three times a week i used to use it every day i didn't know i didn't know any better but now i use it now that i know i use it thrice a week and only at night but it's still as effective as it's supposed to be it's not meant to be used every day i didn't know this so i'm going to behind my ears because you want an even skin tone right okay I don't use so many products at night really. I just go in with my Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair. Honestly, this is not something that I would tell someone to buy. It's not that important. I don't even know what it does for me. I'm not going to lie. But I'm also not really big on skincare. I don't I don't understand it properly. Going to your neck. Okay. So I don't know if I took it out of my routine. Would there be a difference? Blah, blah, blah. I do not think so. Okay. I go in with that. Then I go in with my moisturizer. Uh, it's the Hyaluronic Acid Intensive Cream from Cosex. And I don't use a lot. Let me not lie. Why am I saying that I don't use a lot, friends? It's because I'm broke and it's almost done. What a liar. What a freaking liar. I would want to use more than that. Your neck. Do not forget your neck. I go into this part. Okay? Okay. Now, let me take this back. Come back into the light. Friends, we just do not have money for the bulb for the other side. that 
I told you guys that I moisturize when I'm still done. Another thing that has helped me is this Itoto, it's the Itoto body butter. It has ghee in it. Like I said, I've been struggling with dry skin. Normally I have really oily skin. Do you see that there's some water on my skin? Do you see that? Do you see how it, oh, look at that glow here. Anyway. Oh, your hands, love on your hands. Love on your hands. They're the ones that shake people's hands. We don't want to backbite you. We don't want to shake your hands and then say, ah, Sister Prim, what happened? Okay. So, when I'm moisturizing, I also put some on this part because of friction. I put some on, not in the underarms, but here. But if you want, you can moisturize your underarms. It really helps out quite a lot. Um, so, let me first go into the other parts. Then I'll be back. We choose something to wear. We choose a nighty. And then we can move on. This, these marks here, the bra marks, I make sure that I moisturize them. Oh, the back is still damp nicely. So... Okay, let me first go into moisturizing then because I have to moisturize the whole body like I'm those people who sit down and moisturize the entire body ever since I learned what it does for uniformity for your body to be even the toned and the same color you have to moisturize the entire body so let me first, let me first go into that this is also from Itoto it's a Ugandan brand the same people that make the like a nice soap that I showed you guys okay the soap that I like you don't have to like it but I like it so let me first moisturize and then we'll be back shortly First of all, guys, I just want to show you how chindazing I am, right? Chindazing, yes, thank you so much for your well wishes. <gasps> um, this is my caretaker's bedroom, which also doubles as my studio. This is her bedroom. Very neat. Very, very neat. We don't have a shurak yet, but clutched. You can tell Clutch has eaten my money to the core. So this is also my studio. And this right here is my closet. This is my closet. Let me just put the camera down. Okay. That's my closet. Very, very neat. My jeans and sweats at the bottom. There's nothing to make from here, just showing off. So there's a drawer here that has my PJs. <gasps> Let me show you. Here. It has my PJs, my 90s, blah blah blah. Whatever I wear. So I be knowing what I'm going in with. So now I wear these. So when we wash, we just put them, we just put back. We just restock just restock what's been washed oh, friends another skin my skin looks nice why am i acting humble why am i acting like we were made equal what look at this glow why are we really born equal are we made equal why are we that is a lie that is a lie some animals are more greater than others like animal farm says which i agree so Going with these pages. <sighs> then I'm going to make a cup of tea. Okay. Um, so I never used to live with anyone. It was just me and Bobuna. Then I got sick and I needed help. Like now I'm okay, I'm back to work, but I still don't have an energy. I still need help around the house. Before I just had someone who'd come in to clean every now and then. But now I do need the help. Let me see if I can trim my underarms from here. Yeah, so it's waxing, exfoliating. And those are things that I'll be showing you guys. My mojo for YouTube is back. I can only hope that you guys subscribe and watch and learn something. Okay, so I'm going to remove this towel. So that it can air dry but first i'm going to show you my pjs <gasps> they are quite bigger now oops you see okay <laughs> shout out to people who wear 
sneakers to their bed to sleep you sleep in a party shout out to you anyway, let me just take this to the bathroom so that it can air dry yeah and then we can go make a cup of tea So guys, I'm just going to switch on the thingy for the mosquitoes. Mosquito! Oh! It's on, friends. <sighs> Ruth switched it on. She's amazing! Okay. Now we go to the living room. Hi, Ruthie! Okay. This is our kitchen. So one of my best parts about the kitchen is this, this we got from my friend Sue, Susan who gives me the bathroom scent and I will be, I'll be, I'll put her contact there. One of the things I like, I love, love, love about Ruth is just how nice she is. This is also from Ruth. This right here is also from, I see Ruth, 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 this is from Susan. This is for tea bags. It's also from Susan. So you now know this is Kericho. You know, if you, you it's easy for you to know if you want um, like your nice cup of tea, blah, blah, blah. This is also from Susan. So there's something that I just learned this year from my neighbor who is on Samba Munangi that <laughs> my cooker is a self ignite. Did I know? Friends who has been using a matchbox her entire time in this life. So she told me, I was like, why are you using a matchbox? And I'm like, for the cooker, she's like, it's self-igniting. So she showed us how. She said, as long as this switch is on, the switch for electricity is on and it's plugged in. I know there's someone who is like me, like that, plugged in. You just have to open the gas cylinder. Okay. Then... This is something I also got from Susan. Um, <laughs> there's a word she used that I don't remember to mean that this kettle is good for can go on gas. There's a word she used. I don't remember that word. Because I remember take, we argued literally. And I was just like, no, so three of we are not going to run mad because of you and you know, we're not going to be burnt in this house. And so did like a thousand demos demonstrations for me and my entire family and neighborhood. Like we gathered the entire village, come and see. But guess what? It actually goes, it actually goes on what? It goes on fire. So this is what we call chisubi. I don't know what they call it in English, but it should be, I think, mint. But I don't want to mislead you. If you're watching not from Uganda, I don't know what else to call it. I'm just going to cut some small pieces and oh, we go in with our self-igniting cooker. So it actually makes a sound when it's ready. We have a lot of this in our compound, so. So we're going to just wait in the meantime. Let me just get my phone, scroll through, read messages that I'm supposed to reply. I really like concentration during the day. I get, I get quite quite busy. So as this boils, I'm going to just go through my phone. And but is this skin your ordinary skin? Is this your ordinary skin? <laughs> 
is it is it friends jesus is this how other people are blessed first of all i don't want to brag about how beautiful i look because i know that government will start taxing me yep this government is taxing everything in uganda and might be taxed for just being beautiful so that's why i'm very low on the bragging yeah thanks let me actually give you guys a little bit house tour ruth well to my people that's ruth over there chilling to the few messages read reply finally concentrate as that tea gets ready okay hi guys so our tea is ready and i guess i'm going to just like close this video from here thank you so much for watching i feel like it's been a long video but i felt like i needed to share everything that i shared in this video um this is just like my evening routine like after this honestly i'm trying to upload a reel on instagram and the network here is bogus bogus so i have to sit it out so i'm just trying to upload a reel and then i'll take my tea and then go to bed but thank you so much for coming to the end of this video thank you so much for watching and if you have any questions please leave them in the comment box below please don't forget to subscribe turn on your notification bell so that uh, you are notified each time i post a video and this time i'm going to be very serious i'm going to be posting videos that are very very useful to our everyday lifestyle blah 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 yeah beauty lifestyle whatever whatever i'll be sharing for my life and perspective thank you so much for watching and your supreme good night and from us here at NBS Television, good night.